Well, you know, it really helps to have a race over the track. Free Token is one of four of the 11 in here who had it, and maybe Kenny Rice can find a long shot in that bunch. Several of these mares met here last week at Batavia Downs in a prep for tonight's Breeders' Crown. And as they turn for home, wide outside is Free Token, who was putting a three-race winning streak on the line. And in turning for home, it is Luscious Almahurst with the lead. Luscious Almahurst driven by Ben Webster in his return to Batavia Downs. And it is a battle for the finish between Luscious Almahurst and Cindy's action closing quickly. And that's the way they will finish Luscious Almahurst by a nose in her first win of the season over Cindy's action. And with me, the trainer of Free Trogan right now is Jody Poza. Jody, congratulations on a good season so far. And we were talking earlier, maybe it was a good thing because uh, Free Token certainly was impressive in being parked outside most of the way, getting uh, really a bad post position, but closing strong. And you don't have to worry about trying to win five in a row tonight. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, it would be a little harder shooting for five. At least she gets to start over again. Now, Free Token, you purchased her as an unraced two-year-old. What impressed you about Free Token? Uh, she's got a flawless gait. She's small, but she can trot. She's... I just liked her looks. With 11 going into the turn tonight, how do you see Free Token, and how do you see the rest of the field? Oh, uh, it's scary. Um, you just gotta hope for the best. Luck, um... Luck never hurts. Luck doesn't hurt. <laughs> Good luck, Jody Poza, tonight. Oh. The trainer of Free Token, who is picked as the upset special by the handicapper here. Dave? Let's take a look, quick look at the odds, and we see that Armbro Fling is at 5-2 to two second choice. Free Token at 3, getting a lot of support, and Scenic Wiggle is the 3-2 to two favorite. More after this brief timeout.